You could just get in your car, drive to the supermarket, walk to the dairy counter, and just grab a gallon of milk. But of course, things weren't always like that, and you have a chance to learn all about that here at Sauter Village. Katie's one of the historical farmers here. Uh, tell me a little bit about the process that people actually had to go through to make sure that they had dairy in their diet. Well, most of the time, each place would have a cow. And so you'd supply your own milk. Um, you didn't go to the grocery store and pick it up. You had a cow that you had to milk usually twice a day. And uh, that starts with feeding. You know, you have to make sure she has good nutrition, um, adequate water, she's happy. If they're not happy, they don't give good milk. Uh, so it starts with that, and then you have to go through the process of actually milking. And um, so you, you'd get probably, you know, a gallon or so, enough to feed your family. And uh, I mean, today, a cow can milk, or a good Holstein cow can probably milk about eight gallons a day when she's in full lactation. So that's quite a bit more today than we did last, or in the history, historically. And we have, we've got some milk here, and this is from Curds, who is behind you right there. And uh, to make butter, there's a certain process that they had to go through to do that. Let's, let's go ahead and get started on that process. What are we doing right now? Um, we're going to put it in the butter churn. And uh, this is whole milk. Most of the time, they would have separated the cream out of it, which is the fatty part of the milk. But we're just going to put it in whole today and uh, put the this, churn on. This goes right here. Yes. And uh, so it's all work right here. Yes. Um, how much longer is this going to take for me to make, make butter? Uh, it usually takes us all day to make oh, a stick of butter. All right. So I'm going to be here for a while, guys, it looks like. So uh, I'm going to be making some butter here at Sauter Village. You want any information on Dairy Days? Go ahead and uh, check northwestohio.com. For now, I'm Joe Galley for WNWO Today. Stay tuned.